Hey everyone, welcome to another long awaited and overdue recipe. Today we're going to be making a cauliflower general style that I saw on Taste Made. Um, so stay tuned. Also, I am a little sick right now. I've been sick with the flu for the past week, so I'm trying to get over that. But yeah, stay tuned and we'll get to this recipe. It's delicious, by the way. To start this, you'll need one head of cauliflower. I got the ones that were already cut from Costco and I used about half a bag of this. You'll need green onion just for topping. You're gonna need rice flour, so one cup of rice flour. One tablespoon of cornstarch. Um, three tablespoons of sugar. One tablespoon of baking powder, three fourths cup of water. One fourth cup of veg stock. Three tablespoons of soy sauce. Two tablespoons of rice wine vinegar. Two teaspoons of sesame oil. And I didn't have Chinese cooking oil, so I also used black vinegar, which I didn't put in here. So to start, you're going to want to put your dry ingredients together. So that would be your rice flour. Obviously, I spilled some. Your cornstarch and baking soda. And water. And just mix it all together. Mine was a little bit dry, so I added a little bit more water. Probably like half a cup. And then just mix it up till it was a little... Um, runny and then coat your cauliflower as evenly as possible once that's done you're gonna just want to throw it in your fryer and crisp them up and while that's frying you're gonna want to make your sauce so you put in all your wet ingredients your veg stock your soy sauce rice wine vinegar um, sesame oil sugar and cornstarch and just mix it all together and once it's all mixed you want it to thicken up and they also ask for chilies but I don't have chilies so I just put in chili flakes you can also put in cayenne pepper to give it that heat also and then once it's done frying put it on a napkin so it can absorb all that oil and once they're all done frying I know those ones look more, but these ones look better and then just coat them all in the sauce and you're done seriously if you guys haven't tried it it is really delicious and I really suggest using that black vinegar if you have it it has completely transformed the dish I'm actually obsessed with black vinegar right now and top it off with your green onions you can also top it off with sesame and that's about it I hope you guys enjoy I'm sorry I sound a little sick I have had the flu for the past how many for the past week so yeah I hope you guys enjoy please subscribe like this video if you liked it and I'll also have the taste made link in the bottom of the description for you guys see ya